set bedtime. What am I, five? It's 10 o'clock. You know the rules. I get it. David's coming, and you're getting some. Bedtime. And you're wrong. I know I'm right. What was that? It's the Pine Oaks Slasher. And he's coming for you if you don't go to bed. I heard a noise. Well, I didn't hear anything. You're stalling. Now go. Finally. <sighs> David is coming. No, she's upstairs. Skank. So when are you going to get here? <laughs> Silly. Hey, babe. Oh, oh my god. I'm sorry, officer. Sorry to bother you, miss. But we've been getting reports about a prowler. Oh, uh, where? Oh, we've gotten a few calls. May I come in? No, you may not. Um, I guess, sure. Come on, Ellen. Is there anyone else in the house? Just my sister. Is this gonna take long? We have to check it out, miss. I'm expecting somebody, so if we're good... Are all the doors locked? Yes. And the windows are secure? Yes, the house is practically airtight. Good. We're too late. You got him, Tom. It's over. Just 
Something that's real Give me something to feel Something that's real. Mm -hmm. Finally, what took you so long? Uh, you must be Angela. No, no, I'm Angela. <laughs> oh, hi, hi. <laughs> Drama major. Welcome. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I want us to be friends. Oh, okay. I want us to be close. Oh, by the end of the year, we are gonna be like sisters. <laughs> oh, sorry. What? Look, Angela, I don't know what you heard or... I googled you. I wanted to know who my roommate was. <laughs> oh. You are Ellen Trailer's sister, right? Yeah. No, oh, come on, it's public knowledge. Don't be all paranoid. So how much of it did you actually see? Gee, Angela, uh, <clears throat> all the good parts. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's just that all my acting teachers last year told me that I need more life experience. You are like my own personal gold mine. <laughs> ah, you must be Jenny Trailer. How the hell do you know my name? I'm Tim, your resident advisor. Oh, yeah. Right. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, uh, hi. Hi. Okay. First time away from home. Gold mine. Hey, New York can be, you know, intense. Give it a few weeks, it'll love you back. Unlike certain ex-boyfriends. You didn't ask to be put on my floor this year, did you? Life experience. Well, anyway, make sure you check out the orientation issue of the paper, and uh, can I sign you up for the back-to-school scavenger hunt? It's the best. <laughs> oh. Tim thinks he's putting together a reality show. <laughs> you seriously, scavenger hunt? Rocks. Sign-up sheet down the hall. Oh, no, I'm, I'm okay, actually. I don't... Keep it. Okay, thank you. Just in case. Just in case. Keep it. Thanks. Small penis. No, not at all. <laughs> Sorry. I kind of did it on purpose. Oh. Um, this should work. My older brother says that Professor Henderson gives out the same assignments, like, every year. So now you are guaranteed an A. If I don't, it's your balls. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I mean, promise? <laughs> when I get my A, we can negotiate. Uh, no, we can't. You have so not earned the right to be jealous. Why would you leave this guy on? You got better options, best options right here. He's doing me a favor. You seem smart enough. Why don't you write your own papers? Because I can get him to. I had guys like that all through high school. Did you have a lot of guys in high school? I'll never tell. What's your major malfunction? Chappy, are you scared of going outside? No, not at all. Then go.
to my seat. It's a public space. She really likes sitting there. I sat there before I had my interview for the honors program. You got in. Because you sat in the seat? Three minutes to go. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. You should go in anyways. Yeah, no, though, because um, cause I'm scared of her, so. <laughs> uh. Besides, Ang Angela needs her time. Well, you can wait in my room. And that's not a pickup line or anything. I like bigger girls. <laughs> oh, I'm, I mean, that's. You know, I'm, I'm from North Carolina. Oh. Hey, what you hiding underneath the towel? Nothing yeah. for you. Hey, you're coming to the scavenger hunt, right? Of course, I'm such a joiner. Oh. Oh, hi. <laughs> I'm just waiting for my... God, you are so loud. Roommate. <clears throat> Did I interrupt something? No. Gavin, you stay. I, 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 can, I can take care of the, the wink wink, get the nudge nudge <laughs> myself. <Bye. laughs> I should go. Bye. She's shy and kind of a freak. <laughs> he is so painfully into you. I know. Playing hard to get? Um, no. I am hard to get. <laughs> that came out wrong. <laughs> I... I'm just... I'm... I'm undateable. Ugh. Trust issues. What's wrong? Jenny saw someone in the bathroom. Are, are you sure? If she says she is, she is. You told me I could go in now. Uh, are you OK?
Some people are just too high strung. Jenny, wait, oh. wait, 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 wait. What? Wait. What? Look, I'm sorry. You were a creep. I swear I didn't know it was you. Wait, so you wanted that guy to walk in on somebody? He's lonely. Oh. I kid, I joke, and that's what I do. You're disgusting. I... You're supposed to be in charge. It's welcome week. You're supposed to pull pranks and stuff like that. Okay, would it help if I said that I'm sorry that I targeted you? Bad um, judgment call. What? No. I'm a dick. I crossed the line. I'm sorry. I, I won't do it to you again. And why should I trust you? I promise not to be a dick again. So, safe. All right? Can I make it up to you? How? There's still time to sign up for the scavenger hunt. <laughs> you, you'll make new friends, and hell, if you win, you will erase that this whole paranoid Bye, reputation Tim. thing. OK, I'll catch you later. Um, bye. Hey, guys. Sound from the scavenger hunt, there's only four more days left. Gavin. Gavin. Pull up a seat. I'm okay. I'm just I'm getting a head start on some reading. I could be your cliff notes if you want. this in the suburbs. No, you're right, we don't. Kinda wish I'd grown up in the suburbs. Spend 18 years in North Carolina and you just want more. Hey, uh, do you know why there are so many New Yorkers are depressed? No. Because the light at the end of the tunnel is New Jersey. Where were you? Mm. Oh, I was up at school in the Bronx. Must have been. I can't imagine living anywhere else. My brother died here. It's like he's buried here. Sorry. Yeah, I don't usually lead off with that oh, on the really? first date. <laughs> you seem kind of morbid, twisted, too. Thank you. Yeah, dead siblings have uh, that effect on you. Did Angela tell you? Yeah. She kind of told everybody about you before you got here. Nice. Would you believe it if I told you that? I'm kind of glad she did.
happen. Um, I've lost. You don't have to go home. You've lost if you never leave this room. And Angela needs her space. Hi, Mom. No, I'm fine. I'm fine. Yeah. It's great. I love New York. Yeah, I I even bought the t-shirt. <laughs> yeah. Listen, I have to go, though, because um, there's a new student barbecue. So um, I'll talk to you later, OK? Yeah, yeah. Tell, tell Dad I said hi. I love you, too. Bye. What? You're not the only actress in this room. <laughs> yes, but this one has an audition tomorrow, and if I get it, you'll have the whole room to yourself. You leave in school? Hello, it's a Broadway show. If I book it, I will not need to college. Hey, Angela. <laughs> not interested. Not anymore. Hey, guys. Look, you have no idea how much fun this is gonna be. Don't e no idea. It's gonna be like camp. This is exactly why people think you're unapproachable. Oh! You want me to go? You don't have to. How are you doing with all of this? Days drift by and I don't know. I'm with you. Where I'll be come tomorrow, but tonight. Don't run away and don't lose your breakfast. Have a conversation. Look him in the eye. Be a little wild. Yeah, I, I don't I don't want to be her partner. Oh, come on. You get to be with a sophomore. She's a lot of fun. Trust me, I'm bitter. Yeah, all right. Paula. No. I think that the scavenger hunt would make an excellent story for the Daily Yorker. Relevant to me how? I can uh, get you on staff. You can get me on the paper. God, Paula, for someone so tough, you could be so naive. Oh, plus I scored white stripes tickets for the prize. Backstage passes, too. You know, I have it on strong authority that some execs from Warner Music are going to be there. If you win the tickets, you don't have to take her, okay? Take somebody else. Oh, hey, Camille. Whoa, that, that, that concert sold out. Even my dad's firm can't get their hands on tickets to the White Stripes concert. The winning team? Gets the ticket. What did you say? He said he's gonna win the scavenger hunt. Oh, and Camille. You gonna let that happen? Yeah, Chappie. You gonna let that happen? You do that for me. You're the winner. I'm in. Nobody's getting their hands on anything but me. I'll do it. I'll play your little game, Tim. You have been really patient with me. Thank you. Hey, I was there. But you handle it way better than I do. Well, for one, I leave my room. Okay, if you if you want to go on 
to scavenger hunt thing than go win the concert tickets. <laughs> Will you leave your room to go with me? Mm. I don't want the tickets. And I don't want to be on some stupid scavenger hunt without you. But... You can't stand here forever, Jenny. Stopping your life like this means you're no better off than your sister. How could you say that? To me? Because I say it to myself every day. It's like... If I go outside, I'll get killed. Stupidest thing you ever heard. No. Because you could be killed inside the room. Hmm? <laughs> uh, you asked me how I get through it. You gotta have a sense of humor. So did you really want to go on that capture hunt? Only with you. looking at oh okay sorry everyone sorry sorry everybody sorry I was late I hope you didn't start without me but if you did I'm sure somebody can catch me up all right go ahead we haven't started yet oh good do you want to know why I was late no no I totally stood in line for the open call for spring awakening <laughs> oh wow did you get to sing for them uh that's so not the point does he have to be my partner he so doesn't get me and p.s. You have got to make a costume change before you're going to be seen anywhere in the city near me. But this is my Johnny Depp. It is unfortunately wrong. Uh, all we're missing is Gavin and Jenny. Oh, yeah, she came out. Unlike certain people we know. <laughs> Hi, guys. Where's Gavin? Well, you, you snooze, you lose. Start without him. It's five after. He said he would be here. Is she gonna freak out? Oh, no. She doesn't freak out, she implodes. Guys, I'm right here. I'm not deaf. I'm back. Let's start. You all, this game's supposed to bring us closer, okay? Yo, sorry, Jenny, we gotta start. Okay, you can fill in Gavin when he gets here? All right. Welcome, everyone, to the 12 to 12 scavenger hunt. Yeah. <laughs> cell phones. You should all be receiving a message from Red Hook. I don't have a message. Yeah, I just sent it to you. Oh, no, I mean from Gavin. He said that he was going to be here at noon, and he's not here, so. Okay, well, what do you want to do? The reek. Save Red Hook to your phone book. Trust me, going to come in very handy. 
Now each of you should have a clue. Some the same, some different. You may intersect one another, you may not. You each have 12 to solve. Washington Square Arch, that's our first clue. Shh, so she thinks. When you actually find out the clue, you go to a location where you look for an object. A pom pom? Wait, that's, that's not the object in the clue, is it? Let's listen, people. You then have to take a picture of yourself with the object at the location and then send it via text message to Red Hook. I will then text you back with your next clue to your next location and object and so on. I mean, I don't want to go to Grant's tomb without Gavin. Okay, for those of us who are going to play, what's the catch? All right, it's 12 to 12. First team to get to the final destination by midnight wins. Where is that? He's not going to tell us. It's a scavenger hunt. We're supposed to figure it out. I'll give you part of the answer, OK? For all of you, your first location is in Manhattan. It's not far from campus. But by midnight tonight, you will find your way to a location in one of the other four boroughs. The winning team gets the tickets. All right? How about a little floor spirit? Uh -huh. Huh? Floor spirit! Floor spirit! Come on! Come on. It's all part of the bonding. What do you say? Honey? 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 All right, one, two, three, break! break. <laughs> all right, seriously, where's your closet? You gonna be all right? The green shirt I have is a pterodactyl. Oh, <laughs> crap, I gotta go plant the, yeah, like I'm gonna tell you what the clue is. Hi, Gavin, it's Jenny. Uh, I got the first clue, but I need a New Yorker to help figure it out, so could you call me? But you said piano bar. Um, I was in the right vicinity, the West Village, a piano, and a bar. So what the hell does sing for the camera mean? Do you play the piano? Depends. Give Angela your phone. OK, but I had to design five websites to afford that phone, so. Exactly. Tim knows you have a video phone. Sing for the camera. Hi. Could you do us a favor? Come <sighs> here. Oh, Hello, New York. Live from the duplex. So seriously, that phone's really expensive. How do you use this thing? <laughs> Are you kidding me with this? Some kid came by a week ago, talked to the night guy, convinced him to let our place be a part of the scavenger hunt thing. Now, was the kid really, really cute? A regular Brad Pitts. You know, I always picture Tim as more of an Adam Brody type. Yeah. Ugh. This is so Tim. Hit it. OK. Oh, an internet cafe is the next place you've got to seek. There's a girl behind the counter there whose name is quite unique. Find as Merit, it might not be easy. But as Merit has a hint for you, she'll hand you a CD. Oh, go, Angela, learn to do nothing to get your asses off the stage and find yourself. Are you coming? Don't forget my purse. Hi, it's me again. I feel like a stalker. Um, call me. Well, actually, don't call me. Just come to my dorm room. Paul and Roy are going to win the scavenger hunt anyway. I, I, just, I really want to see you. Thank you, Tim. I am not picking up a used condom from the ground. Ugh, dirt. No, but the clue says we need to find something made out of latex. Wait, I have a condom in my purse. But it has to be used. Hmm.
What? Gavin? Tim? Place. Let's just get the clue. But Tim sent the PDF here, so it should print out behind us. I know my way around a newspaper office. I was editor. Yeah, this is the New York Times. And while I'm here, who can I talk to about an internship? <laughs> Lead the way. Um, need help? I got it. <clears throat> Paula, look at her. It's Camille. You know, I, I kind of see why the fag's like doing it here. Chappy. What? I heard about this place. Yeah, I mean, like, why did the dudes doing dudes get to be the only ones to get to enjoy the outdoors? I don't know. Could be kind of hot doing it in public. Yeah, no, you, you can get caught. And arrested. Dirty. The ground is soft. Oh, you okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Mm. <clears throat> so, uh, where are, we, where are we gonna find a used condom? Around... here. Are you serious? The sooner we get it, the sooner we can win those tickets. <laughs> Really creepy. Yeah. Tim is really good at Photoshop. Coming to a video store near you? Oh, look! He put our names on two boots. Why? Oh, I get it. Two boots. Uh, the, the pizza place. Do I exist? But what does that have to do with a video store? Two boots in the East Village. They show movies. Excuse me? Two boots. Oh, I heard what you said. I just didn't think people were supposed to help us on a scavenger hunt. I got work to do, and you're in my way. I like the way you think. Let's get a picture. <laughs> oh, my. oh my god. I would kill to see Tim's face when he gets our picture. <laughs> That. Must be the next clue. No, no, the clue came on my phone. Who, who the hell is Asmaret? Then I must have gotten a wrong number. Then why did you turn it off so fast? Are you always this cranky after sex? Yeah, I guess. Oh my god. <laughs> is this your first time? Camille, who texted you? No one. Give it up, okay? Look, I know you weren't at home with the cold the other night. What do you want me to say? Just tell me the truth. You can figure it out. Okay, you know what? I'm out of here. You... I'm gonna go find the next clue. If you wanna figure it out, you know where to find me. Chappy? Come on, give me my shirt. Look, I'm sorry, okay? It's even dirtier.
still my sign? God, Tim! Oh, <laughs> planting clues. Why'd you send me those text messages? They're your clues to start the game? But Gavin was not in his room. And, and why did you send me oops? It was really, really cruel. It wasn't me. The messages are from Red Hook. I don't know. Oops is one of my quick notes. I might have accidentally sent that instead of a clue. All the clues are programmed in, see? Gavin is in his room. It must have been an old message. Look, it had, it had nothing to do with your first clue. Grant's tomb? <laughs> you have to admit you're pretty morbid. What does that have to do with anything? I intentionally matched all of the clues with each person in the game. Um, I don't get it. All the pictures that everyone is sending me, I'm putting them all together. It's kind of like a movie. You know, drama, right? Like, I have it set up so that Chappie has to meet up with Higginbottom and Angela at an internet cafe for a surprise clue. We get to see how they get along. So, wait, what kind of situation were you planning on putting me and Gavin into? Thought Grant's tomb might get you all hot for each other. Do you actually enjoy being a dick? Cut your losses. So you got stood up. You still have plenty of time to find another partner for the game. I guarantee you, it is so worth it. The final destination, so cool. Tell me what it is. What is it? You'll just have to be there by midnight. A hint, a hint. Oh. The hint, the clue, is in the clues. <gasps> wait, wait, so all of my clues, what did you say, they're, they're gonna be matched to me? Join the game and find out. Come on, come on. Tell me why you're chasing Jenny and how the hell you got in. It's okay, Dina, Dina. So, do you uh, want to tell me why you're chasing me and how the hell you got in? Uh, yeah. Ah. Mm. That's all right. Yeah, um, your parents were worried about you. And they knew I'd retired up here, so they called me. Uh, why didn't you just tell me? Because they didn't want to make it seem like they were checking up on you. So where were you when I was being shot at? Shot at? Jenny, your parents called me two days ago. Okay, then some, somebody has been following me around since the day that I got here. Okay, have you seen him? Uh, any description? Uh, that's the thing, I haven't, I haven't really seen anybody, but it's just this feeling that I get. Or maybe I'm crazy. After what you've been through, you've got a right to jump at every noise you hear. Why didn't you just show yourself? I was putting your parents before you, and I'm sorry that won't happen again. Can you do me a favor? Can you tell my parents that you lost my trail because I started selling drugs and I joined a cult and my pimp really doesn't appreciate you following me around. Okay, I get it. If you need me, please call me. I will, I will call you if something real happens. And you look like you're in pretty good hands with uh, Annie Oakley here anyway. <laughs> you're leaving? Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Look at you. All grown up. Ew. Bye. Bye. Yeah, and you're welcome, by the way. Thank you for looking out for me. <laughs> uh, yeah, don't wait up. Don't be slow. Are you gonna treat me like this all day? God. Hell, are you gonna treat me like this our whole life together? Are you coming in? Yeah. Well, so now that you know your stalker's not really a stalker, are you gonna finally leave your room? Yeah, totally cured. <laughs> so it works that way. Oh, what did that get there?
Hello. I called you about the video drop box. Wait, when did you? When you were negotiating with the cab driver, I called ahead. You didn't hear me because, well, hearing me is not one of your strong suits. Anyway, uh, we're here on a scavenger hunt that I'm sure that our RA told someone here to put something in a video drop box. So, if you could just open said drop box, we'll be out of your hair. And I'm sure that she'll be out of your hair even sooner because she's always five pages ahead of me. Yep, that guy was just here. He'll show us. Yeah, apparently this is a scavenger hunt. You're supposed to look. I'm not opening it. Man, if he was gonna break up with you in a letter, he'd leave it on your door. Weird. Find Jenny trailer. This had better be the right one, because if I go to another internet cafe, I will scream. I was starting to think we were never going to find someone really named as American. 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 <laughs> you must be from the scavenger hunt. Yes, we are. Wait, that's mine. We, we got here first. Hey, how many of these cafes have you been to? Six. And how many Asmerids have you talked to? Actually, she is the first. You? Seven. <laughs> I have other customers. Oh. It's too small for a door. I'm so tired of Tim's games. Yeah. Uh, so since no one wanted to be my partner for the hunt, and since you've been stood up, you're as big a loser as I am, I say, we screw them all, win the tickets, win the hunt, go to the concert. Jack White could turn me. Of course she'll be here. She's always in her room. Hi. Oh, please, take your time. Don't, don't touch it, don't touch it. Oh. Follow the clues and Gavin lives. Find the final destination before Gavin meets his. Oh, come on. This is not a real finger. It kind of looks like the cadaver we studied last summer. Oh, and I assume the writing is blood? This is plastic. It's a Sharpie. Real blood would bleed. Hey, where's Camille? Yeah, boning somebody else, I guess. And then why are you here? I'm winning those tickets. When Camille gets excited that I did, <laughs> I'm gonna take somebody else. Take me. We could also help you solve Tim. Hey, I thought we were a team here. Oh, come on. You'd mow me down to take Camille. I, I would, I would not. I, I wouldn't. You can have her. Which her, Camille or Angela? I mean. Be done in a minute. Gavin could be really hurt right now. I hate to say it, but Gavin's probably in on this, too. It is not a joke. Gavin would not cut his own finger off. It oh. even is a finger. Jenny, he looks pretty <laughs> fake to me. No. You want to call the cops? We'll call the cops. I'm going to take a picture of the finger and all of us. Come on. Come on. So you really don't care about Jenny? want to win the game. Actually, I do care. I don't want to see you get into yet another one of your cry wolf moments. Seriously, I know you've been through a lot, but you really need to get over this paranoia thing. Oh my god. Okay, she's kind of right. You did think Lieutenant Fox was a stalker. Does anybody think that maybe Gavin is actually in trouble and that, that whether this finger is real or not, that we need to find him? All right, listen, either way, Tim was way out of line. Don't delete the picture. Tim, it's, it's Roy. Please call one of us back. Oh, my God. It's 
Gavin's ring. Stay calm. Let's find Tim. Cinema geek. What the hell is this? Look at the tripod leg. He staged it. Look at the pictures. The guy in the sweatshirt's in on it. Ugh, he is so over the top. I love him. <laughs> what do we do? Well, obviously he wants me to keep playing the game. Men and their games. Mm. Okay, Tim, I admit it. You got me. Mm. Oh. I'm going back to campus. We need to find Tim. Come on. You don't really think he's dead. If he's not, then why hasn't he sent us his next clue? Ha, see? Say Ohm with the princess and the pea. The drama books hop. The gate of hell is open. The gate of hell is open. Nope, not books hop, book shop. The drama book shop. It's where Tim and I had our first date. God, he is so obvious and so alive. Are you coming? Doesn't Camille do yoga? Yeah, a place called the uh, Ohm Studio. And you haven't talked to her at all since you left her? Hello, who's coming with me? You go ahead. Bye, losers. Gate of hell, uh, hell gate, there's a bridge. You can see it from the Upper East Side. Okay, I'm from there. My parents have a doorman. I went to Spence. What? Do you guys really still think that this is just a game? If it is, I'm gonna win it. Look. Oh, God. Well, we better find him. <laughs> Call the cops and her boyfriend dies. Pretty clear to me. Who sent you that text? Uh, Red Hook? Okay, people, Tim is somewhere and he's still being dork dungeon master. I say we keep playing. Okay, but Dina never signed up for this game. It's Tim's way of getting her involved. Okay, okay, um, Vindigo says that there is a bar called Hellgate. It's in Astoria, 1230th Avenue. See, it's a 12 thing. Ugh, I loathe Astoria. So why don't you guys go to the bar, and Jenny and I will walk around the bridge. Roy, where in Astoria did you say that bar was? Paula! Whether it's a game or something else, we have to win. I'm not fucking around. Come on, Roy. Camille might have been a rampant slut, but she never would have in your wildest dreams. I lowered herself to get it on with you. Might have been, what, is she like dead? <laughs> She's dead to me, you wonder you got her. I'm going back to campus. Now you're not gonna find Tim there. Why not? It's getting late, he's probably already at the final destination. Are you still playing this game? Hell yeah, you should too. Why don't you go find Angela? There's someone who'd get it on with you. Call or text me if you find out anything on Camille.
funny. Oh, they're vintage. Okay, I got them in Chinatown, but they're one of a kind. Anyone? Ow! Yes, Dina, I really think that Gavin is in trouble. The picture was real. How can you trust Gavin? I just get him, okay? Okay, there's no clue here. Let's just meet up with Paula and Roy. Was that noise? What noise? There was a noise. Okay, I don't get you. You freak out over every noise, and yet you trust some kid you just met. Shh. Keep your voice down. There's uh. Well, do you trust me, Jenny? Where 
are you, Tim? Trust you. Mm. Jenny! Dina! Roy's gone! Did he finally break up with you? I don't know. He, he went to the men's room. I went to check on him. He's not there. Okay, that's it. I'm calling Lieutenant Fox. Jenny! Open the... No! Oh, good, good, good. She's not there. Where the hell have you been? Looking for this shithead who killed Camille. How do I know you're not the one doing all this? Why would I kill her? I'm going to send a text message to Red Hook. Why? To see if your cell phone goes off. Why are you waiting? Jenny Traley's gonna get herself killed. I have tried calling Jenny a thousand times over from Angela's phone. Look, my cell phone is not going off. Do you, do you trust me? I have all five bars. Oh. Okay, so what do we do now? Find, find the final destination. Do you have any ideas? Uh, the, the destination is the clue. What the hell does that mean? Frickin' New York City. You think you get some frickin' service? Got it. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Mom? Hi. Hi. No, 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 I'm fine, I'm fine. I just, I, hello. Hi, I need, um, I need Lieutenant Fox's phone number. Don't bug me, I'm scanning. It's not gonna work. I already tried mine. You're smarter. Because I saw him today. Yeah, he's in New York. Yeah, because you sent him here to check up on me. I'm, I'm not mad. Just can you, can you please, can you, can you give me the number? Oh my God. I'm an idiot. Please tell me that you're lying. They didn't send him. What? I knew he was a psycho, but how? Whoever is doing this has some sick fascination with her. Okay, but how do you know where you are? Because my parents got me. Oh, GPS phone when Ellen was killed. What are you doing? I'm playing their game. Somebody obviously wants me to. Don't take the subway. Don't take a bus. So pick up your car and come to us. I found the clue. Mom? Hello? Hello? What's wrong? Okay, can you hear me? Where, where are you? Listen to me, Angela is dead. Camille too, and... Hello? What's wrong? It's, it's Higginbotham. Camille's dead. And Angela. Okay, are you sure he's not part of the joke? There is no joke! Then why are we heading into a trap? I... I need to find Gavin. How do you know he's not behind this whole thing? He's not! How do you know that? Because I do!
Okay, well, we're here. What do you want to do? Um, I want to call the cops, and I want to tell them where we are, and I want to have service. Does anybody have service? Um, nope. Mm -mm. I'll go check outside. Don't, 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 don't go out there. Oh, it's fine. <sighs> Nothing. What was that noise? I just shut the door. Okay, now I hear it. What, did I hit something? Let's get out of here. I'm gonna go check it out. Don't. Come on, two people are dead. Yeah, how did we find that out from a pretty shady source? It's nothing. Help me. 
Thank you, Meg. It's okay, Annie. Jenny? Come on, hurry up. <laughs> There, so Tim? No, 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 not Tim. Lieutenant Fox. Who? No, 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 no. Tim's the twisted little Tim? fox. Tim? No. Okay, well, we need to get to a hospital. I'm fine. No, you're not. This is really bad. It was worth it. What do, you, what, do you, what do you mean? You came and found me. Are you all right? Jenny, what's wrong? Did you do this? Don't look sad. Tell me you did not do this. Psycho! like nothing bad ever happened to anybody. Have any of them, any of them ever lost anyone? Do they know what you and I have to live with every day? Kevin. No, oh, it's okay. It's okay. I knew you'd understand. It's all right. That's why I love you. I knew when I met you. No. <laughs> I did this for us to survive together. What if I don't want to be with you? You don't mean that. I'm 
were soulmates. Jenny! <laughs> Back away from him, Jenny. Back away from him. Fourth of July, but I don't feel free at all. 